Hey guys, it is D E T H Cichlid here. Or Death Cichlid. Whatever. Uh this is my new African cichlid tank. I have not made a video in uh, uh like four or five months, something like that. I've checked out my channel. It's just my main camera broke again and again. I keep I keep breaking. That was my stupid brother. <laughs> uh so yeah, I've got the new fifty five gallon, it looks really nice. Uh you have not seen the fish in a while. And last time you saw the fish, most of the fish were like that size. So yeah, I'm gonna show you all of the new ones I got to set up and some of the old guys that you should remember. So the setup's pretty basic. Uh, I've got the male Kenya Kenny Ken yeah, Kenny. Uh he's right there. He used to be the dominant fish, but he's gone down now pretty badly. Uh, I've got the albino zebra or something. Ew, he's really, he's one of my favorite guys in this tank. He's got some really nice colors on him. Uh, the bumblebee, which is getting a lot bigger. He's got to be the, like, the biggest cichlid in the tank. Second biggest, maybe. Uh, there's my other male, Kenya. Kenny. I say Kenya. Why? Uh, Kenny, he's blind though now. He's blind in one eye. If he turns around, you can see. Uh, he digs out everywhere in there. Uh, he won't turn around. Nope. Uh, I've got the red zebra, which has been breeding very often. Most of my fish have been breeding like crazy. I'll show you later. You might have seen lots of babies in the background. There's one. Uh, this is my female pearl mutt, which is having lots of the babies. Got three females in here that keep breeding. So the pearl mutt mixed breed is mixed breeding with like lots of the males. Uh, there's the Joanny. He he's doing really good. He's got some nice colors on him now. Oh, uh, the Gar. He's doing good. He's getting real big. He's going to go in the other tank soon. Uh, the male pearl mutt back there, he's getting beat up a lot. There's my female. Uh, where, she went back in there. Anyways, back in there, I've got a female. Uh... Ice blue. Yeah, that's female ice blue. She doesn't have much color. Uh, my female electric. Unfortunately, the male died on the day I was transferring them into the tank because of too much stress, I'm guessing. And my Salvani, which was going to be in here, also died, but. That's just the bad news. I've got tons more good news. Oh, and uh, I also got the Aratus. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce his name. The male. Oh, if that baby fish will move. There he is. He's back there. I don't know if you can see him. Alright, so here's some of the babies. They're getting really big. Some of them are like only two times smaller than their mother. Uh, yeah, I've got diff three different morphs of the same species. So this one's the tangerine morph. I just call them tangerine morph because they, I've got, they're the most common guys in the tank. I've got most them. There's another one back there. This guy I think is like the biggest one of all the them. 
Uh, Maya Electric's holding right now. She's holding some. Uh, oh, oh, sorry, I didn't mention this guy. This is my favorite fish in the whole tank. It's my peacock. I don't know what type of peacock he is. He's really cool, though. He was the one that was getting beat up in PetSmart. He's got really nice blue and red colors. But I can actually hold him. He's pretty well trained. If it bites my finger, or if, I, if I'm allowed to pet him, like I'm doing now, he gets a pellet. Here, buddy. That's how I basically train him. Once he learns to bite my finger or allow me to pet him, he gets food. But he is my favorite fish in the tank. Now they're all excited. They think food's coming. Anyways, uh, my second morph is the the I call it the African bluegill because if you look at the gill, it's very similar to you know bluegills sunfish when you go fishing. That's what it looks like. So I call him the African bluegill. Then I got the tiger tiger color which is like a light color of the so I might once they get old enough just start breeding them and I might be able to sell them but yeah that's the African cichlid tank the guard is actually trained to eat pellets now I've been training a lot of my fish uh, alright see you later